The opening ceremony of the first symposium on utilization of mineral mangrove ecosystem for human well-being, biodiversity increase and cost protection was held at Yangon University on Thursday. The two-day event was organized by Myanmar Sustainable Agriculture Program, MISAP, and supported by Ministries of Agriculture, Livestock and Irrigation, Yangon University, European Union, and GINZAX. It was the first scientific symposium brought the key stakeholders, including government, expert, private sector, CSO, and local farmers on the subjects of mangrove-friendly agriculture in Myanmar. It was aimed to give a knowledge on the ways for the sustainable protection and utilization of mangrove ecosystem and well-being of people. This symposium is part of a larger program. It's a program that is uh, funded with 22 million euros, which is about 25 million dollars, which is the scientific part of the program and the support uh, and collaboration with the University of Yangon to, to teach students uh, and have a, a bachelor's degree, in fact, on, on fisheries. So this is part of that work, but the, the work goes much beyond. It works with the private sector, with the Myanmar Fisheries Associations, and it's helping farmers both inland and in coastal areas to increase their productivity uh, through sustainable practices. Uh, it's important to remind to everybody that in Myanmar, uh, fisheries has a lot of potential. It's Over 25 local and international academic researchers, experts and scientists were present and discussed about the management of Myanmar's mangrove forex, coastal ecosystem, crucials for coastal protection and shrimp protection. There will be the case studies of mangrove areas in Jiaotan Township that the existing shrimp farmers play the role of mangrove areas protectors. Mostly in fishery management, mangroves are protected and conserved by law, but we have to look back for human well-being. So we will protect the mangrove forest and we also use it for human well-being. It is not only for ecosystem, but also the benefits of people. So the symposium is the first to approach about the techniques, how to increase biodiversity, such as sharing protection and then the cost of protection by using mangrove ecosystems. There is around 12,000 trout and whole shrimp fan register at the Department of Fisheries. However, most of the farms were damaged by the natural disasters, and some of them are now stayed functional and under threat. The utilizations of mangrove ecosystem can protect the biodiversity and coastal areas.